Alright guys, I think it's time to call it a May, and let's talk about my May favorites. Starting with the custom content, as always, we're going to be talking about a few different things. We're going to talk about the Kilati hair by Mr. X Sims, the band-aids from Kismet and Bratz Trash Pack, the, the scallop skirt recolor by Story Legacy Sims, and the Adidas Gazelle shoes by Mr. Usain. Surprisingly enough, we're not going to review any custom content makeup in this episode of Monthly Favorites. I know. What are we going to do? Um, so let's start with the hair. I saw this hair and I was like, yes, for so many reasons, because this hair has so much volume and it's also colored really well. It just has the um, 18 EA standard colors for hair. But sometimes even with the hair that has standard colors, they don't look quite right. But these look on point, so way to go. And also it's hat compatible, which is great. And this is also one of those hairs that's really big and voluminous. But then you put a hat on it and it just looks so cute. Like, I don't know if you, I don't know. Just you put a hat on it and it's just like, it's cute, right? And I don't know, it looks really good everywhere I put. Um, our model for this month, Iris, in a nice teal shade. But I also think the hair looks really good in all the natural colors, especially those really like um, strawberry reds and stuff. They look good. But let's talk about the trash pack band aids. This is a really short thing. There's only a handful of them, but they're so cute. And they add so much character to your Sims. And sometimes people get hurt, so maybe sometimes your Sims get hurt. And this skirt. Guys, so the original version of this skirt is just, as you can see, some ombres, and then they recolored the skirt to add the pattern. I know it's an EA pattern, but I can't think of what it's actually from. And it's just, this is the best skirt ever. I also really appreciate the scalloped edges. Normally when you see skirts, um, I have a ton of them. They're just kind of, you know, like a normal edge or maybe a ruffle. But this person, these people, the recolorists and the original mesh designers went for scallops. And I was like, yes, for diversity in the skirts, right? And these skirts, this skirt also looks really good with leggings and socks and all kinds of different things, which not all skirts do. So I feel like this is a very versatile little number. These shoes I've had in my custom content folder or forever, like the beginning of time. And by that, I mean the beginning of my custom content folder. But they're so simple and they go with everything and they were really matching Miss Iris's look here. So I had to use them. And these are the Adidas Gazelles. And they have like a plain black for if you're just feeling some plain running shoes, but they also have a million other colors. They're ready to go. Let's talk about Sims. This month I did talk about, or I will be talking about one of my Sims and someone else's Sims and Mermaid Week was the best part of this month. If you missed Mermaid Week, please go back and watch it. I think everyone that watched it really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed making it. But this is my sim for Mermaid Week, Lily Waters. I know, I'm super clever. Not. And she was my mermaid, and I had so much fun making her and just playing with her and the mermaid mod and all that good stuff. So, I don't know. I can't say enough about that mod, and I just... I love Lily so much, and I had so much fun creating her and working on Mermaid Week overall. And I know this is a May favorites video, but let's talk about June really quick because I will be doing a theme week in June. I'm not going to spoil it right now. We'll talk about it later. But just prepare yourself, and if you missed out on Mermaid Week, go back and watch it. I did a whole week of mermaid-themed videos. I did a mermaid-themed build. I did a mermaid creative sim, and I played around with the mermaid mod. So it was pretty cool. The second sim I'll be talking about belongs to a friend of mine, Liv the Simmer. If you haven't checked out her channel, you need to. I will link this specific video down below. And then from there, you just need to like just go binge her videos. But this is her sim that she just created um, uh, this week, last week. I can't remember. Video recording makes everything funky. But her name is Jenny, and Jenny is going to be part of Liv's new Let's Play. She's like a yogi and... I don't know. I know Liv has some crazy things planned for Jenny, and especially with seasons coming out soon. So I'm just so prepared to follow Jenny's journey. And also because Jenny's a really well-made sim. I didn't put the entire creative sim in here because you need to go watch Liv's video and hear all about Jenny's backstory and stuff. But Liv spent so much time just on Jenny's face. Like Jenny is a well, 
well-created sim. And I appreciate a well-created sim with a detailed backstory. And Jenny has all of that going on for her. So you need to go <laughs> learn about her. Build time. Like I said a minute ago, Mermaid Week was the best thing this month. And so I had to feature my Mermaid Week build as my favorite build for this month. And that was my Mermaid Lagoon build, which was so much fun. And if you watched my Mermaid mod little video, then you'll know that I did have some issues actually playing with this build. Not many, just two, I think. And so there are a few things in this build that need to be moved if you want to play it. But overall, it plays so well, and I think it's so cute, and it's a great build for if you have a mermaid or if you don't have a mermaid and you just want a cool kind of like funky unique beach house that you have to swim to get into and live your dreams and I don't know it's just I put I didn't I didn't put a lot of thought into this build because it just kind of happened it just came to me and I'm so happy like you know sometimes you like I don't know majors me sometimes I have to really plan out a build and be like all right this is how it has to look and this is the layout I'll literally draw out floor plans but this build just kind of fell together and I love that and it's also a really cool beach house and really cool to play with with the mermaid mod if you do want to download this build very important note make sure when you go in the gallery and you search my username veronica good six not probably simming on the gallery um make sure you check custom to show custom content if you want this build because there is a single piece of custom content and that is this uh mermaid queen statue from the mermaid mod if you don't have the mod the build will work completely fine the statue just won't appear obviously and i only put that in there because i was going to use this build to play with the mod and so i wanted the statue in there and i made it a major kind of focal point in the yard which you'll see if you watch the speed build but overall this is a build you probably definitely need in your world <laughs> and then in game i don't really have a favorite specific feature this month uh, last month, my favorite thing was outdoor retreat. This month, my favorite thing is just kind of playing The Sims. I've been playing with, you're seeing some footage from my legacy challenge, my personal legacy. There's no videos of it. I'm sorry. Maybe we'll do a legacy in the future. Just me and you lovelies, you know? But I do have my personal legacy, and I've been playing with them again, and I neglected them for so long, and I've just been loving it, just like building a family, going through. I have so many, like there's, they're branching out. They're taking over my sim, that the world, and that save, and it's just... Great, and I missed all of that. But anyway, guys, these were my May favorites. I had so, so, so much fun with everything this May, and June is going to be insane because Seasons is coming out on the 22nd, which is, I know, kind of the end of June, but I have some stuff planned. We have a theme week coming up in June. We... I don't want to say too much, but I do have stuff planned already for seasons. I'm trying to work out some stuff for what I want to do with that. And of course, all the usual things like create a sims and builds are on the way. I have a really cool video I'm planning right now that like, if you keep up with me on social media, you might be participating in the creation of, I don't know, but yeah, it was a pretty good month. I was kind of in like a little bit of a slump and then I did mermaid week and everything picked back up and it's just been great. But anyway, I'm going to let you go before I talk for too long. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to download or look at in more detail any of the things I'm talking about, they will be linked down below. As always, you know me. I like to keep you linked. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to let you go. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'd love to know what you think. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!